Good evening and welcome back to Factory Town. Where shall we pick up where we left off? That'd be a good idea. Uh, so we have this up here where we have iron coming in, being made into iron plates. Iron plates are uh, coming along to uh, here. Um, and then we are also making nails here and nails come along to here to make reinforced plates, which is fantastic and wonderful and joyous. But we need to double this up because we also need to sell reinforced planks so they're going to come down well not sell we need to export our reinforced planks so they need to be placed here which means this needs to be changed but we couldn't do that because we've run out of reinforced plates to build the packages but now we have the reinforced plates so let's do this let's do this so how about we grab that and put it down we grab all this here Uh, in fact, let's delete that as well there. Let's grab all of that. Copy. Paste. And that should just work. <laughs> should just work. Yeah. Yeah, this should this should just work. This should hopefully just work. Um, let's delete that. And uh, we will copy a and have you pack it into a grate because we want to pack, pack them there uh, we need to come out of this one and come along to here so let's copy all of this and paste it there by copy pasting it copies all the recipes and everything so we're, we're good for that um, I don't believe I need nails but here we're going to do steam pipes so that'll be fine and uh, we want to leave that well we don't want to leave it there actually we want to um, pause there a moment Move the barn to there. Then put a packager here. I'm not sure if I need to um, export iron plates. Um, well, I think it's, oh, it is called iron plates here. Yeah. I'm not sure if I need to export iron plates to... Um, To the world i'm not i don't i don't know i don't think so i think everything that you use iron plates will probably be in this area here we might have to make more iron plates uh which may be a problem uh because we'd have to go around here so i don't i don't i don't want to um i don't want to move this like up and down i don't really want to go around it or up it so i we well, i'd have to figure out something for this i'm not quite sure what we're going to do to to get down underneath and back up again we'll we'll, we'll figure that out we'll figure it out but um yeah, right now we we'll do this. Uh, what I'm going to do here um, is uh, come out there, um, and I'm going to, if I can get the mouse to line up with the, um, uh, I'm going to come out to, oh, hold on, hold on. So did we come out of three? I think we came out of three. I don't know why we came out of three, but we did. Don't like that. Uh, this will be iron plates. It only can be iron plates anyway. And then we're going to split it here. Rather than come along and down here, because that's in the way, if we come here, that means both of these can feed both of these. Uh, so it just balances between the two. Uh, I would get, I would, yeah, yeah, balance between the two. Okay, uh, so we'll get rid of that side of this completely. Um, and we will also delete that for the moment. Do that. Okay. Delete that. And then we'll have this come along here. Turn that way. Put in a support block above that. And we can have that come along by one and then come it doesn't matter it could be it could be the same height it doesn't really matter to be honest with you um actually it does it does not matter how that goes in there so long as it goes in there it doesn't matter um uh, but it would look better if it's higher there we go like that but um, and then we'll change this guy here to face forward and then put a splitter in like that and there we go so now we've got two coming in, coming down this line in the centre and splitting evenly between the two. One for us, one for packaging to go out into the world. 
Now, most things have stopped working and aren't doing what we need them to do. Uh, that is because we don't have enough uh, iron What am I doing here? No, no, don't do that. Um, I seem to get my mouse into where I want to go to there. Um, we don't have enough iron to uh, actually feed all of these, so we need more iron coming in, iron ore coming in. To do that, we need another iron ore train. Where is our iron train? Is it you? You are indeed the iron ore train. Okay, let's click that. We'll copy this. Okay, and then we will copy you, and we'll put you on. Now, I don't want to put it on the opposite track, down the opposite way, because that won't work. Because we'll come down here and won't go anywhere. It needs to actually be on. This track, right? What town number is this? Three. So yeah, so it needs to be on three. So it wants to be behind that train there. I don't know why I've got inputs for uh trap five coming down here, because trap five should never have to connect to trap three. So I don't know why that's there. So I'm gonna remove those on both of these. I think that's an oversight on my my behalf. Oops. Uh, that one's go through there, that goes through there, and then this is clockwise, so this one's anti-clockwise down. It should just be the anti-clockwise and clockwise ones that connect to it. Uh, I'm not sure why. Mm. Oh, I guess I copied something else, didn't I? Yep, copy, paste, and then we're going to add three cards to you, and then we're going to do the same again. Uh, bunching the trains up doesn't really matter. You don't have to spread them out uh, because they will stop here to pick up. So they'll, they'll always fill up here and they'll stop the other end to hold and fill up. So eventually all your trains will end up bunched up anyway. Um, so, and, and then they'll spread out. So when they're going to hold, drop off, th this will drop out till um, this train here can't do anything anymore. Um, and uh, can't, it has empty, sorry, and it will go. And the next one will come along, it'll empty one crate, and then another crate, and another crate, and another crate, and didn't, and then it'll go. They'll all, they'll all balance themselves out. Sometimes they'll be bunched up, sometimes they'll be spread out, just like buses. You never quite know when one's going to come along. Um, okay, so pause that now. Something went wrong with these trains. You are five drop off and three pick up. This is a three pick up. Why did you go straight past this? Hmm? Because neither of you are filtered to be iron, because even though I copied the previous train, it did not copy the stuff I wanted it to. So you need a tag and you need the uh um filter. Yeah. Okay, that's cool. That's cool. Right. Do, 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 do. Sneaky, 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 sneaky. All the way down. Oop. Coal shouldn't be too bad uh, because coal is. Um, we, we use. Like, coal converts to four. So, um, uh, when you're boxing up something, so it takes four items and it boxes it. So, in this box is four iron. So, in this box is four coal. And then a coal piece becomes four fuel. So in this one box is 16 fuel, uh, which is quite nice. I think it's four. Is it four? Is it four? Yes, it's four. Yeah, so in one box is 16 fuel. So this gets a uh, uh, box in, it stacks, stacks to 16 in there, or 18, 20, well, it stacks to 20, I think it is. It comes out, um, this fills with coal, and yeah, coal, coal is not a problem. Coal, iron, iron, however, is desperately the problem. Um, we will probably need... Uh, Two, if not four, iron mines. And maybe one coal mine. I'm not too sure. Uh, this, however, doesn't need to be running anymore. Um, so... Let's 
let's um, do that and empty that back. Oh, sorry, I put you off a little. Go. Um, and then let's just get rid of this here because we don't need this anymore. Okay, we have that elsewhere now, so that can go bye bye. This can go bye bye. Okay, let's um, remove the forester. This wasn't all just a temporary setup anyway, in order to clear up, uh, in order to get some reinforced planks so that we could actually live, um, because we had no reinforced planks at all. So. Awesome. Okay. There you go. Put on, put on, put on. Right. Okay. Okay. So that's all fine. That's all good. Are you? You are running as fast as you can. But yeah, single shoot is fast enough to output everything there. Same for you. Okay. Oh. Right. Okay. And we have a broken. A bro ah. Okay. So this is. This is something that I did think could happen. Uh, if you remember a few episodes ago, I explained that it, it is possible that a train could come down as a train is coming up and they hit each other, that like both of them have hit each other, so neither of them can move, move uh, which means I need to make adjustments to this. This system doesn't work as intended. Um, so what I need to do realistically is come down eight here and then join, so the train's completely clear before it crosses the track. Which probably means moving this stuff, which is awkward as hell. Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Yep, right there, right there. However, it doesn't need to come down to eight. It can actually come down to seven and do that, or maybe even six. Let's go down to six and then cross the track like that. Um, and then let's move you to be there. No, that's still not enough. You are still blocking that track. Okay, so you need to come down at least seven to free that track up it's really awkward it's really awkward because I, I I'd have to move the entire forestry over or, or I could just you know have it there or maybe even have the train um just miss the uh, the forestry on the way in and only get it on the way out which is not ideal um these will get on the way in this doesn't get on the way out uh Hmm. How do we want to achieve that? Yeah, I suppose let's move it. I suppose let's move it, which means we need to... Because I want to kind of conform all of them together. Um, if that makes sense, I want to um, uh, make all of them... Uh, follow the same design. I mean, I've got to change the other ones as well to match this, which is kind of awkward, but not exactly impossible. Oh, what's going on there? Uh, press the button. That's what's going on there. Aha! Uh, let's do this. So we'll do this, and we go page up. Um, we can technically page up just once, and it still works for the trees. But I'm going to do it twice because it's um, it looks nicer. So let's do that, and then we have to go underground to our water layer. And do that to there, and that to there, and then copy and paste that there, so they're both outputs. But there you go. So wherever we have a uh, an output like that, like here, we change it. Now we did actually have this different anyway. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, in like that. There we go. But on. Uh, this one is different anyway. Oh, I don't think this can go eight because there's trees there. We might have to chop some of the trees out. Yeah, we'll just chop some of the trees out here. I don't, I don't, I'm not, I'm not faffing with that. <laughs> um, like that, do that, but on. Th this should never actually run into itself because of the way it works. Um, but this does because it has a one pickup and a one, and a, and a, a, a four drop off. So, so the four drop offs come down. And so, yeah, so it's, um, 
so everywhere we have that uh we have to do that this is fine this is fine this is fine this one is a mess here because i still haven't moved this town here so that's fine and that's yeah we haven't got a return yet so okay cool right okie dokie okie dokie so throat traveling everywhere losing my mind um this all works fine here is this doing the job now is it getting the iron in we have 190 100 over 200 iron in there that's good this is coming down here these none of these have iron ore in them though that's the problem so this this is what i was thinking so i'm thinking that we're splitting it and then splitting it and then splitting it so we have one line coming down and we're splitting it uh five ways it's going to be splitting it six ways i don't think that's going to work for us um yeah i don't i don't think this is going to work for us so we're gonna to have to do something a bit different with it so um let me turn off the grabbers in fact let me just turn off the coal grabber for the moment because we need to empty the coal out because the coal was said is four times the amount so we need to empty the coal out once we've emptied the coal out i can redesign this slightly and i think what i want to do is have the coal on a lower layer down below now we can go like this we can go too high like this and actually put belts in there which is technically lower then uh um no because that 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 is too high so we can go even one lower than that that's still legal that still allows the uh the town to pass through fine the problem to it is that that doesn't allow caravans to go through there um if we go to the caravan and i say would you move there it goes round okay but if i tell the caravan to go here it will go under that so it needs a two clearance and I'd like to leave a two clearance because we are going to have internal deliveries. If we need to sell something to this town that this town produces, we're going to have a caravan do it. So we can't go that low, but that is an option if we desperately need it. But I don't think we will. I don't think we will. Um, right, let's now turn off that. Actually, no, let's leave that on again. Um, but yeah, I think what I'll do is we will bring in a coal line on the lowest layer layer here and then we're bringing two iron lines either side of it one higher so we'll have a, a coal line here and a coal and an iron line there and there so i can see all three lines um, and then this one will feed three and this one will feed three so let's grab all of uh, let's delete that and then grab all of that put that there okay stop um, stop the game because don't paste 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 change this to be steam pipes copy paste 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 and then paste 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 oh, there you go okay i should also filter this to be iron plates and filter this to be steam pipes um although i've not had it in years because i haven't played this game in years but i haven't had it for a long time um sometimes your caravans and your people um, any, any unit that can carry something if you give it an order to do something else it will drop off its goods in the nearest storage it can which means a barn that isn't filtered could potentially get something in there if something went wrong it, i don't think it's ever going to happen to us because we're not using units apart from caravans to move things around and they're going to have designated things but it's a fail safe it's a fail safe try, always try and filter your barns if you need to and anything else that you need to filter filter individually so um it's, it's always a good idea plus if you look at a barn and it's empty and you're like why is it empty i don't know what it is you can glance at it you can just click it and be like ah oh, it's filtered iron. it should be full of iron plates why is it not full of iron plates again for this one not so much because um we know this is an iron plate producer but potentially for um other ones it, uh, it, you, if you've got a uh, barn in the middle of somewhere you might be like well, what is that supposed to be i don't know you know filter it it just tells you it just makes life easier um you can't name them unfortunately um but yeah okay okay so how's the iron come in so the coal is still because there's no iron come up to the end ones up here which is a little bit annoying um
turn the iron on and get some just come in. I'll delete the uh, the splitter so the iron ends up up here. For these two. So just to take the coal off the off the line. Because I don't want to take the box, I don't want the box stuff to be in it. We've already got loads of box stuff in the main base. Where is the main base? Uh, right there it is. Boom. Uh, we've got boxes of nails, boxes of coal, boxes of wood, boxes of pack grain. See, I need to I need to start taking stuff out of this. Um, two things. Uh, the I believe when you build, it takes it from the storage first. So we've got 1,730. So if I put down that, that's, uh, sorry, uh, 2,416. If we spend 10 of them, boom, we have 2,416. So it's not taking it from here. It's actually taking it from, um, I guess, the barns first, which is actually kind of annoying because it goes back into here by default. Look. It always goes into this one by default, but it comes out of the barn, stored around first. I don't like that. I don't like that. I really wish there was a way to um things. And you can't filter these, <laughs> unfortunately. Um you, you can filter like each individual one, but if you filter them all and then something comes in that it's not got a filter, it will just create a new item for it. It's it's yeah. Um you need to output these. You can delete them. You can just click here and be like, oh, well, we don't need wooden rails anymore. Delete. Goodbye. You know, and it just gets rid of them. So you always have that option. Oh, I've messed up here. Something's not right. Something's not coming up here. Why are you not coming up here? Oh, you stupid hedgehog. There we go. And by put this in and yep, yeah, that's why nothing was going up the end. Oh dear, oh dear, oh dear. There we go. Let's fix that. Let's fix that. Okay. So let's uh oh let's get rid of this here. Oh, I just deleted that. Oh. <laughs> That's okay. That's okay. That's okay. What I'm gonna do is I'm literally just gonna grab the entire path and delete the whole thing. Yeah, it's gonna make life so much easier for us. Um, could you stop? Uh Over you go. All right, there you go. Let's just delete all of that all the way down. And that too. We can repair the path very easily. Doop and doop. There we go. Ooh, every time. Every time. Um, there we go. Right. Uh, this needs repairing, but not yet. Not yet. So. I'm going to bring in this guy too high because we have to. Now, could I get lower than that and still have a caravan go through there? One, two. No, because we have to be three high and that would sit at the same height anyway, so there's no point in doing that. Oh, uh, and that's also another thing as well. It is entirely possible to delete um, things. Uh, <laughs> um, that are flying. Bom, then we'll go uh, another one. Well, actually, these two want to come in. Yeah, so we do this. No, we go up to there. Pause the game so stuff doesn't actually come down here. So to there. And then we go to there and to there. Dum and dum. Dum and dum. Make sure it's going forward and put the splitters in. Dum, like that. And then we just want to go and do a two high there, a two high there, two high there, and a two high there. And I think a two high here. Yeah. Um, and then you actually do want to be one higher but i don't know if you can pull out of it if it's one higher so i think we'll actually come down to here what's going on here what's going on here 
Okay. I hold control and just drag this all the way through to the end here and same here drag hold control and drag this all the way through to the end there that works uh, you can go that way you can go that way nope try again I feel like I keep putting Stuff down like underneath that I'm not seeing. Hopefully it's all in the correct direction though. I'm, wor I'm worried that I'm putting that block underneath there. Um, that I've, I've, I've clicked on put one in the wrong place there. So, uh, and then we'll have a splitter, a splitter, a splitter, a splitter there. Now, if I wanted to even this all out, we could figure out the ratio. So this needs to go forward to. And left one, this goes full one, left one, and that's fine. So we could, uh, sorry, right one. Um, and then this would go forward four, left one, right one. But I'm not going to do that. We're just, we're just going to let it balance normally. Um, and see how it goes. And see how it goes. Um, using a manifold setup rather than a balanced setup. But we have the option to balance it if we wanted to. Um, so if I need to even out how much stuff goes into where, we can do that. Um, so yeah, we can we can split this. So we can say um, one left, four forward, one right, and this goes one left, two forward. This goes two forward and one right, so on and so forth. And then and then then this would get one, this would get one, this would get one, and then this would get one, this would get one, this would get one. So that would that would that would be f let's let's I'm, I'm talking about it let's do it so i'm gonna move the camera like this because this represents up right down and see here up right down so uh right is one forward um sorry left is one up 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 is one um forward is going to be two and that is going to be zero okay and then this is going to be this opposite zero two and then here, this would be one, one, and zero. And zero, one, and one. And then this one doesn't have a splitter, it just turns left and right, so that's fine. And this one basically wants to go left, right, wants to have four going forwards. So we have one, two, four, which then splits here. So this would have two going forwards. So four going forward, two going forward, split. There you go. And this would have zero going forward. And that's better balanced to even up the goods between all of them so uh that'll hopefully work better for us uh we need to build a balance between the two let's put a zero in there it doesn't really matter to be honest with you um the, the balancing but it, it, it can matter um if you're trying to do even things stuff like that. i said i wasn't gonna do ratios and stuff like that it's not really ratios that's more just making sure that every place gets the resources it needs so um yeah that'll, that'll, that'll be fine that'll be fine okay okay and changing that zero going forward doesn't matter it, it doesn't at matter at, at all so um yeah uh the bypass option on this one you see there's a bypass option uh that means that if it tries to go like in this instance it tries to go left um but it can't because it's blocked up if you have it bypass it will just send it all right instead if you have it set to hold if it can't go left you wonder it will evenly split hold means that it will go left and right left and right if there's nowhere to go left it will wait to the space then go right can be useful again if you're doing special builds where you need to make sure this one has so many things and this one has so many things because then later on they become something else so you're not doing that but if, if it backs up then it, you're just starving this one so something else has gone wrong somewhere but 
could be if you've got two different ratios of doing stuff. Uh, you might want to make sure this has three of something and this has one of something. And you don't want this to carry on and fill up a storage when this one's... Uh, well, again, stuff backs up. You don't really need it, but it's it's optional. It's optional, so... But anyway, that's going to work for us. It's going to do the job. Um, this is not going to get any steam pipes because... You are not set to store steam pipes. Steam pipe, steam pipe, steam pipe. Did I say that's a steam pipe? There we go. But on, there you go. Now we're storing steam pipes. Awesome. I didn't really want a thousand of them. We don't need that. Oh, well, actually, we probably will because we're going to steam a lot of the place up. So, steamy windows. Well, steamy factories. Anyway. Thank you very much for watching, everybody. I hope you have enjoyed this one. We got there in the end. Yay. Our first actual proper production line system in place. Fantastic. Now we just need to export the goods and do whatever else we were doing with them. But until next time, as always, have fun.